message, then I am already dead. Most likely at the Arteria Cranium. Maltzel will not return alive from Big Box. That leaves you as the sole surviving member of Orca. I'm asking you to do this in my stead. Take the Cranium. If you succeed, the Cradle's last support will be gone, and mankind will be forced to return to the surface. Then the anti-satellite batteries can use the energy from the Cradles to eliminate the assault cells and clear our path to space. It is all up to you now. Do this for your fellow Orca warriors and for all humanity. Target the two next, Ryder Palash and Mindless. You've chosen your answer. Our guests have arrived, Wendy. Right on schedule. You don't hesitate to kill for humanity, do you? Then lay down your own life, like Thermidor before you. Thermidor, betrayed us. This is your fight to begin with. The man called Thermidor has already passed. The man standing before you is rank one, I'm starving. Roy, forgive me. It's all in your hands now. Don't take this on all by yourself. Confirm. Enemy next destroyed. Ryder Palash has been destroyed. took control of Cranium. Without the energy needed to support them, the cradles fell to Earth. In the devastation and poisoned air of the planet's surface, infants coughed feebly in the arms of their despairing mothers, while the anti-satellite batteries continued their steady charge. When their power is finally unleashed, the web of assault cells over the planet will be destroyed, the sins of the corporations purged. Even as humanity is decimated, they will discover a new frontier, outer space. A new direction at last. It will be a time of growth, of ambition, and of war.